Well, you're about to meet one brave little boy. Ten-year-old Jackson Bartlett was snorkelling with his dad near Coral Bay in Western Australia when he was attacked by a shark. The two-metre bronze whaler bit Jackson on the foot, slicing it from his ankle to his toe. There it is blurred out. Terrible injury. Thankfully, though, Jackson is OK, and he joins us now from Perth Children's Hospital with his parents, Blake and Rachel, and brothers Sammy and Leo. Legend, Jackson, Yay. how are you this morning, buddy? <laughs> I'm good. Oh, tell us what <laughs> happened, buddy. Um, there was a shark that came behind me and it tried to bite me three times. Oh, no. And then what happened? Um, then, um, I told, um, said that to Dad there was a shark and then Dad, I showed him my sword and then he rushed me to shore and then some other... And then all the doctors bandaged it up. Oh. Goodness me, I tell Dad you what, what really a healthy. story yeah. you've got to tell. Hey, Blake, you're in the water with Jackson. I mean, this is any parent's worst nightmare, mm. isn't it, when um, your kid gets attacked by a shark? <coughs> yeah, as, as, as we said, it's um, not something you need to go through every day and hopefully we don't have to go, to, go through it again. But um, he was very brave on the day and he's been very brave since. So. He's one little trooper, that's for sure. What was it like for you in the water at the time when it all happened and, and the immediate aftermath on the beach and everything? Can you talk us through all that? Yeah, I, we didn't realise... I didn't realise he'd been bitten at first. I thought he was just pointing the shark out to me. So just after it actually happened, he um, said shark and I looked down. I'm like, oh, cool, bronzy, like decent size and then all of a sudden he started swimming towards me and that's when I'd realised he'd actually been bitten. He said, I've been bitten. So I quickly rushed him to shore um, and then once we got to shore we had, very fortunate, we had um, two doctors on on the shore just happened to be there at the time and they treated him. We got him rushed quickly to the nursing post and then he got airlifted to Perth. Lucky little fella, I say. Now, look, Rachel, you were on the beach with, with the other boys. You were just about to get into the water. Is that right? How was it for you? Yeah, I was getting, I was getting the boys in their wetsuits and um, Blake and Jackson went out for a little bit first and I was actually down the other end of the beach. So I was a bit unaware of what was happening until a bystander came running up the beach saying, ''Are you Rachel?'' Um, and I said yes, and she said, oh, your little boy's been injured. She didn't say anything about a shark bite, and so I came running down, and then Jackson was uh, quite distressed and saying a shark bit in me, and obviously gave him the biggest cuddle and helped, but at that stage it was bandaged up by the off-duty um, doctors, so I didn't see the extent of the injuries until we got to Coral Bay. Just generally <laughs> speak... It's very scary. Yeah. It's very scary, and he's been so brave. Just generally speaking, um, in these circumstances, it can be the dad who can get blamed for such injuries, um, given the activity. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, no blame at all. <laughs> no blame. How fortunate to have the doctors there as well and, and all the emergency services um, just to get um, him looked after, seen to and off to hospital as quickly as possible. Incredible. Oh, very incredible. We're so, we're so lucky and we're so grateful and so appreciative to all those people that helped out. Thank you. Hey, guys, I know you've, you've been travelling uh, around on this great family adventure for, for a couple of months, but, um, Jackson, you know, all, all your schoolmates back home... Oh. You have a pretty cool story to tell them, don't you? Uh-huh. Um, I, hopefully I can go back and spend a week there to rest it and um, I'm going to tell all my friends if I go to school for a day and say, um, this is, um, it, I got bitten by a shark and tell them my story. Oh, it's amazing. And, and look, you'll be able to give um, one of your friends right now, you mentioned your best friend, um, that will get you in the good books with your best friend. Go on, just say, say his name right now. <laughs> Um, I got lots of... You get lots got lots of, of good answers. <laughs> <laughs> good answer, son. Uh, but you'll be going back in the water again, Jackson? Yeah, I'm just going to start from deep pools and shallow salt water. Yeah. And you'll go back in, though. What do you like about sharks? 
Um, not their jaws. <laughs> Good answer. What a great answer. So, Sammy and Leo, out of 10, how brave is your brother? Brave. 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 Yeah. Well, good on you guys. Look, we're real glad that the, um, the story ended really well. Jackson, all the very best, mate. You're a little legend. And well done um, to Mum and Dad for, for being able to cope with it all. It would have been very Staying stressful. Calm. Yeah. Thanks, guys.